It's the morning of the Saturday's official calendar shoot in East London. The designers have been tasked with coming up with a complete head-to-toe collection, inspired by the 50s motorcycle film The Wild One. The band will shoot both outfits, with only the winning photograph appearing in the calendar. All of the losing team will face elimination. Showcase day is always nerve-wracking. It's the best part of the week and the worst part of the week. But Team Megan have got a big problem, an incomplete look. Can't lay the blame on anyone right now. The shoes that Megan ordered over the internet only two days ago haven't turned up. We literally trawled websites for hours and we couldn't find any shoes that would go with the aesthetic of the little collection. And we finally found these and we were like, right, this is the ones, you know. We ordered it and it said it takes two to ten working days. Let's think of some options, right? What are our options? I put a wedge on my trainer and make Molly wear it. I don't care. I can't think of anything worse than going home just because of shoes. Yeah. We'll just bang on about the shoes. Like, we've got head to toe look, head to toe look, head to toe. <laughs> Guys, we're doing good, we're doing good. I feel like we've got a really cohesive, good, strong yeah. look. I can't believe Megan sat there eating breakfast, so they might not be panicking as much as we thought. And things aren't getting any better for Megan. Who did that? What? Look how bad that oh is. Oh, my God! Who actually did that? Oh, mate, I need a bag. That's painful to look at. Megan's just realised that the back of the dress doesn't match up. This line, this should be continuous, but it's, like, raggedy. And then there, also, I don't really understand how that happens. I just can't think about it anymore because it's stressing me way too much. I'm so upset, it's beyond belief. There may be tears. One of us in this group has got some bad karma. <laughs> I think it's me right now. After a quick repair job by Ralph, the mentors accompanied by the Saturday stylist Frank have arrived. Morning, everyone. Can I get you all to come and gather round, please? So, today isn't a normal day. This isn't obviously a normal showcase for you guys. Um, today, we're going to be observing you on a professional photo shoot. I'd like to introduce you to the stylist, Frank Strachan, and he works with the ladies. So he'll be guiding you through the photo shoots today. Megan. I'm stressed. Why are you so stressed? Um, the shoes that I ordered on Wednesday didn't turn up. So we don't have shoes. That's a bit of a problem then. OK. But you're going to figure out how to solve that, right? We'll make yeah. it work. I can't wait to see how you do that. I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> OK. Um, Heidi, have you had any issues like this? No. I made sure we allowed not to rub it in at all. But I made, no, I made sure we had a bit of allowance of money left over so that we could get any last minute things should we need to. So say the shoes don't fit or anything, we can just phone up, order it or run out and get it. Um, yeah, happy. Megan, what do you have up your sleeve? Um, well, basically, I know there's going to be two motorbikes uh, in the sh photo shoot. So um, I'm kind of got an idea of how we can place the girls and then crop like two inches from the bottom of the, sh so you can just see the, the wheels and everything like that, but crop it so you can, so it looks like they've got shoes on, but they actually haven't. They look like they have no feet. It's your party, you can cry if you want to. <laughs> to go home because of <laughs> shoes. <laughs> no, don't cry around me, I'm fine. After an intense few days where Megan seemed to have it all under control, her pastel and print bodycon collection looks like it will be completely let down by a lack of shoes. And despite her more hectic approach, Heidi's managed to get her fiery chiffon and studs combination totally finished. With the Saturday's arrival, the chance for Megan to sort her problem out is rapidly disappearing. We can't wait to try them on. Yes. Shall we get? Yeah, yeah, let's get going. OK. Yeah. Bye. Heidi gets to dress the girls first. Thank you. Where were we? OK. Yeah. 
With a few final adjustments, Team Heidi's outfits are ready to go. In just three days with a budget of £1,000, Heidi's team have managed to put together a complete collection for the photo shoot. Ta da! Oh, Jesus! Oh, oh my God! <laughs> I'm getting electric shocks like off this skirt. <laughs> um, Jacqueline's just electrocuted Una by trying to get rid of the static. <laughs> right. I really want to do it. Let's do it. Yeah. Right, we're ready. <laughs> <laughs> Yummy. Let me take a closer look. <laughs> <laughs> yes. That's it. Yeah, yeah. Great. A bit more? Oh, that's cool. I love the raw detail on Rochelle and Vanessa. Yeah, it's so good. pretty. Love that. Control the face, perfect. Oh, you know, I love that face up there. Love a bit more. Good. Yeah. Okay, let's go. Yeah, love. Yeah, Molly, chin up. Yeah, that's it. Yeah. Thank you very much. Heidi, yeah. are you happy with how it looks? Yes, yeah. it looks amazing. I'm so happy. Aww. Thank you that's for making good. it look so good. Thank you. Oh. Three and two teams of room. I'm so, 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 mad, mad, mad. Hashtag go hard, go home. <laughs> I can't believe that four weeks ago I was at home jobless. And now I'm styling the Saturdays, like my first ever fitting was with Rochelle from the Saturday. It's like, how on earth does that happen? Like, it's every person's dream. Like, even Henry was like, I'd love to dress these people. Hey, Megan. Hello. Right, I think it's Unwilling to let the second shoot happen without shoes, the Saturday stylist Frank has stepped in to save Megan. You're in look, I have got some shoes. Have you? So oh, thank you. Can... <laughs> we love you. Oh, That's all right. You, we you love can you use all. mine. Oh, this is nice. Thank you. Ah, thank you. Thank you. <laughs> yeah, we're all good, so okay. great. We've just got to hope that it doesn't look so good that they want to keep the, you know, that it's all about the image. It's the image and then the, the look. And yeah, at the end of the day, it's about the calendar. But the judges should take into consideration that it's not the shoe. So with Frank stepping in at the last minute, Megan's bodycon look is ready for the second shoe. The shoes, though, are amazing. The shoes are cute, but the shoes aren't theirs. Yeah, I know, but... <laughs> they don't look as comfortable in this outfit as we did in the last outfit. Though. This is way more pin-up. Yes. Yeah. on everyone as well. Yeah. That's okay, a girls, wrap, bye. everyone! <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Oh, thanks, thank you. Thank you. Despite all the stresses of the day and everything, once I saw the clothes on the girls, my God, they look so beautiful. Hopefully, fingers crossed, I don't end up in the room of doom. <laughs> we have to eliminate somebody, and we're having a really hard time figuring out how to do that. We don't get to dish out the praise, we don't get to pick the winners, we just get to pick the losers. Let's just get them in here.